Welcome back to our fourth installment of Let's Play Rome 2. We've been playing with Macedon. Ready for battle! And we're at war with the Epirus. They are currently being sieged by the Ardea. Uh, that's really unpronounceable. Uh, let's call them the Ardes. Yes. We've been looking for a uh, naval battle. And next turn we'll be having one. Hard on the oars, you men! Spartans have been on the move. We still have a good win. At your command. Yeah, let's cancel those. Ready for battle. And let's wait for the Ardis to lay off the siege. We've been uh, saving some money for the Holosideris barracks. There's not much to do at the moment I think, so let's enter. No technologies. Unacceptable. Let's go with the uh, Hoplite barracks. Maybe? Workshop. Yes, I'll be wanting the workshop. How much was the oh the blazing thunder cats? Can go level up. Spy at least. Let's go with murder. Uh, yeah, we might cancel the recruitment of those units for the moment. It'll get us some money, which will allow us to build the Holosideris barracks. And that'll be cool. Commander. So let's. We enter. hunger for battle. Yes, let's enter. Wise enough not to sit idly upon the bank, but to take the fish as it swims by. Yeah, let's do it. The payments hundred. I'm not gonna pay you guys. Congratulations on a So if I'm correct, Apollonia is for the taking. Okay, we have the Traveler's Lodge. Commander! We hunger for battle! Do I want the Heralds to fight? Make Maybe haste, men! We hunger for battle! How old are you? Since it's only uh, every every turn will be a year, the generals will age very fast. Let's check him out. 43, okay. Well, that's not too old. Ready for battle! Yeah, I'm gonna fight with the blazing Thundercats. Is that all? 
Ready for battle. None will escape. Laying siege to the settlement. None will escape. Commander. March. Okay, so let's do this. I'm not gonna fight it on the map. I already tried it. It's it's one of the missions. Um, but if I'll subjugate a faction, they'll just continue to wage war against uh, Sparta and Athens. So it'll do me no good. I'll occupy them. Is that all? We hunger for battle. Commander, that's cool. Infantry commander, yeah, he's gonna be an infantry commander. And infantry command will be available at level three or four. Yep, rank four. Ready for orders. Fleet reporting. Ah, and we'll have a naval battle. To battle! You, you. Oh, and it'll be a tough one. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. This will be the first naval battle I'll be playing. Not only in this Let's Play, but um, in my entire Rome 2 playtime. So I'm really interested how it's gonna turn out. Okay, so how are we gonna do this? Those are javelin Our man. Missiles await your orders. Can I fire flaming arrows? That'll be cool. I can. General! And how to ram? Oh he can Give do the fire! flaming shot. Toggle ramming and boarding. Okay. Support ships ready! I thank my ancestors that they have given us an easy path to victory today. See, the enemy are weak, and we are strong. Do not cast aside this opportunity for an easy victory. Make ready. Okay. Warriors of Macadon! To the oars! Set oars! Support ships ready and waiting! Okay, this is going way faster than naval battles in Shogun 2. See, do we have a map? Oh yeah, one thing I'm still not using Who optimally wants? is the tab. Which allows a strategic overview. Yeah, it's nice also be very useful. Out. Oh yes, they're countering. Now your orders Ready yourselves. Ready. 
Our general is under attack. Let's ram him. Ready. Attack, brave sons of Macadon. Well, it wasn't a great ram. Do I see some hull damage? No, the entire I don't. unit has perished. Good. An entire unit? Holy At shit! At your command, support That's ships. cool. Set oars. Orders understood. Oh. Ships ready. Faster, reload. They Our shattered. men flee the field of battle. This is a shameful display. Support ships ready and waiting. Warriors of Macadon. Fire on the enemy. Our missile. We are losing ground. Reload with haste. Orders. No, we're Orders losing water. Reload. Let's go. By your command. Our men flee the field of battle. This is a shameful display. Ah, that was cool. <laughs> Devas. That's that's awesome also. Uh, I'm, a, I'm a big fan of the Song of Ice and Fireworks and Devas Seaward might just be my favorite character from the entire series. Um, it's point of view from the books, it's it's awesome. In the series he isn't too impressive and maybe he isn't in the books either. But, uh, his, his points of view have been my favorite ones. Yeah, let me explain. Devas is the, for, for people who don't know a song of Ice and Fire or Game of Thrones, uh, Devas is the, is the admiral, the main admiral of um, a claimant to the throne of Westeros. We will return! Yes, we will. must rest a while. In due time. We hunger for battle. Ready for battle. How much can I do with him now? Yeah. Not what I want. Commander. So, let's see. Paris has been destroyed. Which has been fun. Uh, oh yeah, we have... Oh, we haven't completed the province. And we might just attack Sparta. Get rid of them before they become a bigger threat as they are. And they might just already be Your orders. too much. Let's find out. Yeah, let's find out Ready in our battle. next episode. We'll be uh, exploring the options of an attack on Sparta. Um, we'll be well, I should do it now. I should check up now on what the, the plague is doing. Yeah, conquest. This is it too interesting? Oh, there's the plague here. There's the plague. Event minus 10. And it'll probably cause a drop down. Accumulated growth. Growth creates population surplus. So town growth is basically population growth. Okay. And even though I have the plague, people are just unhappy about the plague, but they aren't really dying. It's like a bad case of influenza going around. 
maybe. Do they still have the plague? Yeah, events minus 10. They still have the plague. Okay, so uh, this was the turn. Uh, it was also the fourth episode of our Let's Play, and I'll see you. I'll see you next time.